Welcome back guys, on this episode we're talking about Evil Affair again, this is for Nikki fans and Nikki lovers Um, this episode Nikki is about to find fight with that winch called Kapalika and um, we just hope she defeats Kapalika Don't forget to subscribe as we jump set into the video of today The episode starts with Kapalika telling Vikram, Sumitra and others that she will kill them Vikram and Sumitra ask her to forgive Nikki, thinking that she's innocent and childish Kapalika asks if they are fooling her she pulls and kicks them and then she ties them with the neck. She says that she will show death to Nikki first and goes inside. So Damini is hiding and looks on as Kapalika enters as a black smoke appears in front of Nikki. She says, you little daughter-in-law, I have welcomed you into Buranga and today I will do you farewell. Nikki starts reciting holy mantras. Kapalika keeps hands on her ears in pain. She then asks if she is done as Nikki stops. She says inauspicious things will happen in Buranga and says that people bend down in front of evil. And promote a sin when she says today i will snatch your breath from you she attacks her with a snake from her mouth and hits it on the wall she says today you will see my anger and today you will know that death itself is afraid of her is afraid of her kapal is afraid of kaplika is afraid is afraid of kapal rani she says that i will kill you easily i will torture you so much that the helper has to come in front of me then i'll kill her too she asks what is your truth and why is Baudevi helping you? Nikki thinks that if this is a voice of Baudevi, she says that I'm a normal orphan girl of Goa. Kapalika says either you don't know or you are lying, saying if she was normal, simple, then Baudevi wouldn't have helped you. Nikki says God is with me and Kapalika says don't state God's name and says that I will take your life. Nikki says life and death is in the hands of God. Nikki moves backward. Kapalika says here. Yeah, Kapalika says here, yeah, just God's name is taken. Nikki smiles and Kapalika standing near the cross. She jumps and takes the ass and says that I will take God's name hundred times and says God and says God and says and says God's name. She breaks the rope and the net falls on Kapalika, which is tied with holy stuff. Kapalika feels the body sensation and Nikki throws Ganja on her and says that it will not let you live. Sundamini is watching everything. Nikki brings the burning coal and says Malik and you have met our family as they've and says why she says that she says you will take me to malik else i will never free you kapalika says that i'll take you to malik but first i'll kill you i will drag your body in front of him and then he will eat you nikki asks her to stop worrying about her and instead worry about herself she asks her to take her to malik it is her last chance kapalika laughs and flies in the air she shouts loudly nikki keeps her eyes Keep her hands on her ears. Kapalika breaks the net and tells that she is the queen and Nick and Malik's slave and Nikki is a small aunt in front of her. Nikki throws the stool into her. Kapalika breaks it and asks how dare you. So Damini gets shocked and Nikki is not there. Kapalika asks her to come out of the hole and face her. So Damini thinks that she will not move else Kapalika will attack her thinking her to be Nikki and she will die. Kapalika asks Nikki to come out. Nikki comes there holding a tree shoe. And you guys already know what that tree shoe means. So that stuff that they use to fight goddess. I'll actually put the picture here. Pirish comes back with uh Pirish comes back with the herbs and calls Sungana and Rohit takes Nikki's name in unconscious states. Nikki asks Kapalika if she's searching her and attacks her with the tree shoe. Kapalika moves and the tree shoe hits the wall. She attacks Nikki. Nikki shouts Pirish. Pirish has Nikki calling her. Arohi takes Nikki's name and Pirish thinks that what did Nikki do now? He makes Arohi smell the heart. Kapalika hot Nikki and makes her fall down she then drags her to the snake we are she then drags her with the snake from her mouth and then swallows the snake nikki shouts pinush around he regains consciousness and tells pinush about nikki's war with kapalika pinush is shocked kapalika then keeps her foot on nikki she asks did you see my power what is the consciousness of my power what is the consequences of my power and says i'm alive since many years and your god stuff can't even harm me she says you will die now. She takes her demon avatar is about to kill Nikki when Pirish jumps in front of the balcony. He shrouds on Kapalika's head. Kapalika falls and Pirish asks Nikki if she is fine. Kapalika attacks Pirish and makes him fly in the air and then push him down. He, fl he flies in the air. He fades and Kapalika holds Nikki with the snake, strangles her, strangles her waist and neck and asks her to call her divine powers to save her. She says even God knows that she will die today. If she comes then I will kill both of you then. Bad Devi says Nikki is in trouble. So guys, this is I don't know. This is bad for Nikki. I'll pause the continuation actually because I feel Nikki actually defeated this Kapalika and this wipe. The next episode I'll post might be the last time you guys will see her 
in this show. I'll see you guys there soon. Bye, guys.